Now I know this is this is a major fight. They're all big, but uh, you're talking with the G-man now, so this ought to relax you. If you get by this interview, you can beat anybody. I'm good to go. <laughs> yes, yes. Thank you for being here today. Appreciate you guys coming out and uh, seeing what we got going on in camp. Well, we're glad to be here. It's always a good camp when you're here. You're always a, a good host, really, and uh, I wouldn't miss it. Wanted to bring up the fact that uh, you know there's so much talk in this fight prior going into it. There's in in most fights, but the, the bad blood and this and that. How do you get that? You know, there, there comes a time when you just have to push that aside and and just just keep your eye on the prize and what you want to do. Yeah, I mean. Um... You know, he. This is a passionate sport. This is not a sport where you can be some in and some out. You got to be all the way in. And um, I'm passionate about what I do. I'm all the way in. So uh, he feels like he's going to do something to me. I feel like I'm going to do something to him. He's expressed that to me, and I've expressed that to him. But that's natural in the sport of boxing. Um, at the end of the day, I want us to both come out healthy. You know, we have families to go home to, friends to go home to. So, uh, but you know. As I said before, this is not just my job, it's not just my career, but this is my life. So I take this personal. And anybody in the way of me trying to get where I'm headed, that's personal to me, and I got we got to figure that out. So how how have you? Uh, I don't want to get too involved here, but how have you evolved as a fighter? Uh, Seventeen undefeated, seventeen wins. I mean, uh, what what have you mastered in the sport since you started? Um, you know, I've always had the athletic ability. I've always had the speed. I've always been fast. I've always been, like I said, athletic. But just sharpening those tools, honing them, and not just being, you know, as we all know, Roy Jones was great. But as he got older, he didn't have the fundamentals to fall back on as opposed to someone like a Bernard Hopkins. So um, we know that that speed, it doesn't last forever. That athletic ability, it won't last forever. And we need... Um, and also, in moments that we're in trouble or we're hurt, that's not always going to get us out of that. But the fundamentals, the skills, that's what's going to get us out of trouble. That's what's going to carry us in and give us longevity in the sport. So um, just over the years with Justin and my dad, especially Justin, man, as far as fundamentals go, he is he is sharp with that. So, uh, yeah, just, just honing my skills, that's all. For the new year, 2019, this is uh, you know this is the first fight. You want to stay busy. I know you, you because of the injury, you had a lot of off time. But uh, what are you looking for in 2019? Is it a, a breakout year for yourself? Uh, absolutely. I know that um, I know that I'm known in the sport of boxing. I know that the true boxing fans they know about Caleb Plant, but. Um, this fight moving forward, I don't just want the boxing fans, but I want the world to know who Caleb Plant is. Um, I want to share my skills with the world. I want to share, share my story with the world. And uh, yeah, I think 2019 will be a breakout year. I, I want nothing but health and wealth for 2019. So, Well, keep your eye on the prize. As we said, uh, all the best uh, in on uh, the 19th, is it, or 13th? 13th. 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 Okay, yes, on the sir, yes, 13th, we'll be keeping our eye on you. Stay well and... Uh, Thank you for your time. We appreciate it. Absolutely. Thank you. Appreciate you guys.